Hi guys, this is Mungai Kihara. Welcome back to African Real Estate. Today we are at Picket Home. This is an estate located at Motalia along Kangudo Road. That is exactly 200 meters from Kangudo Road. The estate contains 21 units and the print area of each unit is 143 square meters. The price is 5.75 million. Before wasting any minute, let's start the tour. Each unit is built on a 50 by 80 lot and they come with a two car parking like this one and a front yard. The units also come with a sizable foyer area and a shade for your gazebo. Let's get inside. Wow! I like the living room. It's spacious, it's beautiful and the natural lighting is perfect. Just look at these windows. You have a window here, another one there and another one there. This Three windows in combination bring maximum lighting to this living area. As you can see, the living area is spacious enough to fit your big couch. The living room also comes with very well crafted gypsum ceilings. And on this other side, you have your TV area. As per now, you have a very small TV, but this space is big enough to fit your 55 or 65 inch. On this opposite side, you have your dining area, and on the far end, you have the kitchen. Let's have a look at the dining area. Just follow me. As per now, the dining area is set to hold four people, but this space is big enough that the dining area can hold to a maximum of eight people. Let's have a look at the kitchen. At the entrance of the kitchen, you have this area that is set aside for your refrigerator. This kitchen comes with upper and lower cabinets, and they look splendid. The kitchen also comes with these four drawers here that are sufficient for your cutlery and your crockery. Next to me here, you have a space that is set aside for your cooking stove. The kitchen comes with the dark granite countertops all over that matches very well with the whites of the cabinet. This is the sink area and it comes with a double sink. The sink area comes with this big window that sets maximum lighting while you are doing your chores. The faucet of this sink area also acts as a pot filler. Interesting. Let me show you the pantry of this kitchen. This is the pantry of this kitchen and it's not very big, though it's sufficient for your family. From the pantry, I'll use this door to show you the laundry area and the employee quarters. Just follow me. Between the kitchen and the employee quarters, you have this section that is set aside as your laundry area and it comes with the sockets for your laundry machine and a drain trap. This is the employee quarters, but I'll not show you that because they are using it as a store. Let's get back inside. Each unit at Pickett Heritage comes with two wings. On my left hand wing, we have the living room, the dining area, the kitchen, and the SQ. On my right hand wing, you have all the three bedrooms. Let's jump to the first bedroom. Wow, I like the bedroom already. On this side of the room, you have this setup here that acts as a small office or a study area of your kids. The closet of this bedroom is here. This closet and all the other closets in this unit are very white and they come with a sectioned part here and an open space. They also come with a, a drawer down there. The space is not that big but is sufficient for your kids. On the opposite side, you have the bed area and the bathroom of this room. This bed area is big enough maybe to fit your two boys or your two girls. Let me show you the bathroom. At the entrance of the bathroom, you have this wash basin. And the bathroom comes with all the other showering amenities. And if you notice, this bathroom comes with a very beautiful shower head. We don't have an instant heater here. This is because each unit comes with solar water heaters. On the opposite side, you have the water closet of this bathroom. Let me show you the second bedroom. The second bedroom is just directly opposite to the first one. Let's get inside. Just come in. This bedroom is slightly smaller than the first one and it comes with a bed area here and a closet on this opposite side. 
Let me show you the closet. This is a floor to ceiling closet and is slightly bigger than the one in the first bedroom. As you can see, you have an open section here and a drawer down there. The closet also comes with a sectioned part here. Let's have a look at the bathroom of this bedroom. This bathroom is exactly similar to the one that we saw in the first bedroom. And it comes with a water closet, a wash basin here, and a showering area. The bathroom is big for kids. Let's go to the primary bedroom. From the two kids' bedrooms, the primary bedroom is on my right hand side. But before I show you that, I'll show you the shared toilet. Just come. At the entrance of the shared bathroom, you have a wash basin and a toothbrush holder. On this far end, you have a separate toilet. Let me show you the primary bedroom. The primary bedroom is here. Wow! This is a very big primary bedroom. And I love the colors. Just look at this bed. The bed is already 5 by 6 and the space is big enough to fit a 6 by 6 bed. Just take a minute and look at the size of this window. This will set maximum natural light to this room. On the opposite side, you have the closet of this bedroom and the bathroom of this bedroom. But before I show you that, you have a mirror here to admire yourself or maybe admire your partner. Let me show you the closet. The primary bedroom comes with an L-shaped closet and you have massive storage here, a storage here and an extra storage here. You also have a drawer down there. The bathroom is just behind me. Just come. In this bathroom, you have a water closet, a wash basin, and on the opposite side, you have the showering area. That's all for this bathroom. We have come to the end of the tour. This is Picket Homes. And guess who I met with? It's Edna from Natural K Tendi. Hi, how are you? <laughs> I'm Edna. Uh, I have a channel. Check it out when free. <laughs> Make sure you subscribe to her. She mm -hmm. does very good content. Thank you so and much. And also subscribe to this channel and like this video. Yeah, thank you so much. Bye for today. Bye.